Hello everyone, Techno Sleuth Craig Chamberlain here. Today we're going to talk about antiviruses. AVG Free, Avist, and Avira are three of the most popular free antiviruses in the market. Today we're going to talk about Avist in particular. Now if you look at Avist at the download CNET page, you will notice that the reviews are absolutely fantastic for this software. We have the CNET editors rating 5 out of 5 and the users rating 4.5 out of 5. <laughs> look how many users there are too. 11,340 votes. I'd say that pretty much qualifies as a good uh, sample size for you know, averaging out whether it's good software or not. Now, if you go to my website, www.pcmichiana.com, I did put a link to this download. If you scroll down to the bottom right-hand corner, there's free antivirus, and you'll see Avist Home Edition. That's going to redirect you to CNET's download page, and you're going to be able to download it from there. Now, once you've downloaded it, go ahead and run it, and it'll run you through this installer, and you'll click Next, and it'll start downloading the entire software package for you, and that will let you install it. After it is downloaded, it's going to run you through the Avis setup command. Now, it's going to basically tell you that it's strongly recommended you to exit all Windows programs. Just go ahead and make sure you do that. And of course, you want to only make sure you have one antivirus installed at any given time. Click Next, click Next, read and agree to the license agreement. Click Next, and then click Next to install the software. Go ahead and leave everything at the typical installation and click Next. Go ahead and click Next one more time, and the installation will begin. After the installation has completed, it's going to ask you if it wants a boot time scan antivirus of your local hard drives. If you're suspicious of having a virus already, I would definitely do this. I'm not suspicious, so I'm going to go ahead and click no, and I'm going to restart now. The screen's going to come back after I do my reboot. Hi, welcome back. After you've restarted, of course, it's going to bring you up with this registration page. You have 60 days in order to register the free edition. It is free to register. It will lock you out after 60 days if you don't. You can go ahead and do it right now, but I'm a lazy procrastinator, so I'm just going to click OK. Now that's going to open the Avis Resident Protection. That's your real-time protection. If you get any kind of infections in real time, it will catch them. This is one of the most powerful resident protectors. It's probably the most powerful resident protection, real-time protection you can get in a free antivirus. It's better than AVG Free, and it's better than Avira. Now, double-click on the A. You'll see the statistics of your resident protection. That's all running in real time. It's protecting all these various ports on your computer, and it's also scanning files as you use them in real time. Just click OK. If you double-click on the Avist icon on your desktop, it's going to ask me to uh, register my license key. I don't have it yet. I'm just going to demo. Now, for most of you, when this uh, interface comes up, I'm not a huge fan of how they have this interface laid out. It looks like a CD player, a really bad CD player. Yeah, I believe you can change the skins, but most of you are going to use this update feature, which is the lightning bolt if it hasn't already updated on its own, and then you're just going to click on the hard drive to do your real-time scan. It's one of those great pieces of software that's out there for scanning your uh, computer for viruses and for running real-time protection in the background. When you look at it in comparison to AVG Free and uh, Avira, you'll notice that it does have a better review rating for users. This one has four and a half. If you go to AVG Free, it's only four. It's not it's not a huge drop, but obviously there's a, a bigger user base for reviews. And for Avira, it's more of a three and a half out of four. Avira is a more lightweight scanner. AVG is a little more lightweight than Avist because it doesn't run a real-time scanner, but Avist is going to give you optimal protection. But if you have a really slow computer, Avist is probably going to slow down your computer more than AVG Free. So pretty much go with whichever one suits your needs best. Avist, if you have a fast computer, is going to be the best protection and the best real-time scanning. AVG Free, if you have a semi-fast computer and you need good protection or adequate protection, but you don't want the real-time scanning to bog down your processing power. And Avira, you should go with if you have a lower-end machine and you need a real lightweight antivirus scanner. That's all there is to it. If you're at my YouTube channel, please subscribe if you like this video. Of course, leave ratings and reviews. And I hope you guys found this video useful. Don't forget to uh, swing by my website and uh, stick around for future videos. I'm going to do one every day. See ya.